time in the time okay okay can you say i was busy yes i was busy <laughs> all right so how are you today what are you doing i'm fine thank you mm -hmm. um i'm i'm um i'm studying oh you are studying okay do you have many classes today uh i have um I have six classes on Tuesday. Okay, and you have six classes. All right. So, did you do our homework? Yes. yes. I okay. I downloaded it. Okay. What about did you eat your breakfast? Yes. Uh, I'm eating. You're eat. You're eating today. Yes. I mean, you're eating at the moment. Okay. So now, um, how? We will check your homework last time. Okay, I told you to uh, write 10 uh, words with a sound in 10 E sounds. All right, and then I asked you to make five sentences for E sound and I or oh, E sound. All right, so let me share you my screen and then let's get started. Can you see it? Yes, I see. I can see. Okay, so here I told you to practice these words. All right, so now let's practice first. I read. Yes, can you read? Lemon, lemonade, lemonade. Okay, very good. Lemonade. Okay, can you read the sentence? Yes. Uh, I like drink lemon lemonade with some sugar. All right, I like drink lemonade with some sugar. All right, can you say I like to? Oh, can you say it again? I like to drink. Yes, teacher. Uh, I like to drink lemonade with some sugar. All right, very good. What about this one? Mm. Vegetable. Are you sure? Vegetable? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Are you sure? Uh, sure? <laughs> that is? Yeah. It's? Vegetable. Okay, it's so veg. Vegetables. Vegetable. Vegetable. All right, veg. Can you say one more time? Veg. 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 Yes, vegetables. Yes. Vegetable. Vegetable. Yes. Yeah. Vegetable. Don't say tables, okay? <laughs> yeah. Do not say tables. It's not tables. Okay. Yeah. It's vegetables. Vegetables. Vegetable. vegetable. Yes. Table table is this one, right? It's not yeah. table. Okay. <laughs> All right. It's a food. Vegetables. Yes. Yeah. All right. Let's read the sentence. Yes. Uh, Vegetable, vegetables are very good for healthy. Okay, so vegetables are very good for healthy. Your sentence is good, but you should say vegetables is good or vegetables are good for health. Okay, vegetables are good for health. Or you can also say vegetables are healthy. Oh, yes. Okay, vegetables. If you wanted to use the word healthy, you can say vegetables are healthy or are very healthy. But if you wanted to use good, you can say vegetables are very good for health. Okay? I'll type you that one. Vegetables are very good for health. And the next one, vegetables are very healthy. Okay? All right, so next one we have here. All right, I want you to practice more about vegetables, okay? Yes. <laughs> All right, but you did a great job. Now I want you to read your 
um, homework with A and E sounds? Yes. Uh, pen. Get. Let. Red. Zest. Wet. Ten. Send. Remember. Empathy. Okay, very good. Next. Uh, feet. Sit. Beat. Hit. List. Kids. Jeez. Peace. Employee. Teacher. All right, very good. So, who teach you this one? Did you find this on Google? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So very good. Pen, get, leg, red, yes, wet, ten, cents, remember, empathy. Okay. Next one is feet, seats, beat, heat, list, keep, cheese, peace, employee, and teacher. All right. Very good. So now let's move on with your sentences. Make yes. five sentences for E and five sentences for E sound. Okay, we have here a sound. Uh, she has a pen. Okay, very good. Uh, Marie gets her mother to cut her hair. My mm -hmm. dresses. My dresses are red. Okay. I remember my homework. All right. I remember my homework. <laughs> he has 10 classes on Tuesday. Okay. Is this the spelling of Tuesday? <laughs> All right. You, you are missing letter E, okay? <laughs> Tuesday. Oh. Yes, okay, it's fine. <laughs> yes. All right, Tuesday. Okay, very good. So your sentences are also correct. Okay, next one. Uh, my teacher has name is Hua. My teacher has name is Hua. Are you sure? You can say, my teacher is Hua. Or you can say, my teacher's name, okay, my teacher's uh, name is Hua. Yeah. All right. You cannot say my teacher has name for Hua. Yeah. You can also say this one, my teacher has a name. All right, but it is better if you can say my teacher's name is Okay, or you can also say my teacher is is Hoa, right? Oh yes. If he's a boy or a girl. All right. My teacher's name is Hoa or my teacher is Miss Hoa. Okay, next one. Um the mouse likes cheese. Okay, the mouse likes cheese. Next. Uh, the employees of my company are very hard working. Okay, very good. Can you say company? Company. Company. Okay, next. Yes. yes. Uh, what gives the, the bread in the freezer? All right, very good. So one, two, three. Oh, you just you just made four sentences oh. for e sound. Oh, what? Oh. One, two, three, four. Right. <laughs> oh. Okay. I so you forgot. Okay. So mm. one. Uh, um. How you get ten here? Five oh. and four. Okay. <laughs> All right. So you got how many? 19, right? 19 out of 20 <laughs> because you forgot the other one. But I want you to fix or be careful with your sentences, okay? Yeah. Like this one. 
and spelling also. You need to look carefully for your spelling. All right, very good. So now, huh, thank you so much for doing your homework. You're always doing your homework and that's a good thing. Okay, good job. Thank you. Yes, okay, so we will now move on to our new lesson for today. It's Unit 14 after school club. All right, so let me see. Okay, we are done with this one, right? Yes. Past tense, all right. Let's move on with this one. How about this? Are we done also with this? Yes. All right, this one? Yes. <laughs> yes. This one? Yes. Uh, do you remember this one, huh? Uh, do you remember I, this? I remember, I remember. Did you study this one at home? Yes. Yes, all right, very good. So these are rules to remember, okay, when you are going to add regular verbs in the past. So the first one is, if it is ends with E, you just add two, you just add D, okay? If it is consonant plus Y, you change Y into I and then add ET. Yes. Right? So if it is a consonant, vowel, and consonant, you will double the last consonant plus ED, like the word stopped. Okay? Yes. Next? All right. In other cases, you only need to add ED. Okay, so example here. All right. So, ha, huh, do you remember the past simple tense? Yes, I remember. All right, you remember. Okay, so we will learn another structure here. So here we have positive structure and negative structure. For example, we have the subject, the main verb, and the object. Yes. Okay. So we also have the negative one, subject plus didn't, right? Or did yeah. not, and then infinitive plus the object. All right, we also have here yes or no questions, like any read? Yes, uh, did add subtract and v infinitive. Uh, okay, and object. R, R as object, yes. Yeah. All right, and then you were going to answer yes, subject, did for example did you eat your breakfast you will say yes i did all right yeah. did you do your homework no i didn't okay oh, yes all right so we also have here b can be was or were yeah. okay so next one we have here oh let's practice all right you are going to answer this activity so try rewriting the sentences in past simple, okay? Yeah. So you are going to write again the sentences in past simple, all right? Yes. So I'll, I'll give you two minutes and then tell me when you're ready. Okay, teacher.
teacher and finish. Mm -hmm. All right, so that's good. So we have fear number one. Can you read number one? Yes. You you answered it already, okay? Yes. Uh, and the and the tight 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 joined, okay? Yes. Uh, a chess club at school. Yesterday she played. Yes. Okay, he him. played. Yes. Yes. Uh, with his friends in the club. Mm hmm Very good. Next. Yes. Uh, last week. Sarah, Sarah helped, helped, helped. Okay, helped. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Her mom to the dishes. Her mom, her mom gave, gave, her mom gave, gave. Okay, gave. Okay, gave her two dollars. Okay, very good. Number three. Uh, last month, John and Mary went fishing. Okay, very good. Went fishing with her grandparents yes uh the weather was sunny okay was sunny yes after going fishing they went camping mm -hmm. grandma 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 cooked grandma cooked okay cook <laughs> yeah delicious food they danced danced all right dance what did you add d right they dance okay next happily there all right number four yeah um to the light skipping. okay like skipping yeah. she skipped skip In. very good what okay what is the spelling of your skip what did you add skip skip plus uh, can you spell? Can you spell? A uh, skip, a uh, skip t. <laughs> oh, is, uh, skip. I want you to spell s k. Um, s k i b b. Okay. B. All right. Yes. Very good. You need to add another p. Okay. Yes. And then e d. Okay. Good job. So that is skipped. She skipped in break time. Yes, uh, she skipped in break time at school with some friends. They uh, they had, had fun. Okay, they had fun. All right, very good. Next. Yes. Uh, Harry had a temperature last weekend. He stayed. Okay, in, very good. He stayed in bed. Yeah, in bed. And what? And what is, uh, and what, and what, and what? Okay, watch. I'm tired. Cut okay, watch on cartoon. Day. Cartoon on day. Um, he 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 took he took he took. Oh, I took. <laughs> I took. All right, he took. Okay, he took some medicines some too. Medicine. Yeah, too. Okay, that is the past tense of tick. Okay, it's tick. All right, anyway, you did a great job, huh? You know how to make it in a simple sentence, a past simple tense, okay? Yes. All right, very good. Next one we have here, this activity. So we have here, read the passages, match the numbers and the letters. So you are going to match Match numbers to letters A, B, or C. Okay? Yes. All right. So let's read number one. Uh, when Park worked at a school, she helped children in a playground. The children walked, helped, and skipped. Some kicked and, and bounced a bond. The children always laughed a lot at playtime. Okay, number two. Yes, Todd lived in the countryside. He loved sport and and he climbed and oh, sailed a class. 
Good luck. Okay, good, good luck. Yes. Very good. Yeah. Next. And silk. A very weak. When it rained, he can't. He ran. Bread and they played badminton inside. All right, very good. Number three. Yes. Uh, yesterday, Davis invited his friend. Sister invited? Jungle. Is it invited? Uh, invited. Invited. All right, invited. Yes. Uh, his friend used to go skating. It was very cold, so they needed hats and scarves. It says uh, scarves. Uh, scarves. Scarves. Yes. Scarves. Uh, okay. Next. Uh, it started to snow, but but she skated on the lake. David pointed and shouted because she was she wasn't careful. All right. Very good. So now, how I want you to choose your answers here. Um, which one do you think is letter? Oh, number one. What letter is number one? Uh, I think um, I think number one is C. C. All letter right, C. C. Yeah. Okay. What about number two? Uh, number two. Number two is letter A. All right, letter A and number three, it's number oh, number three, it's letter D. D. Letter D. D. Yeah, okay, very good. So this is, all right, when Pat work at the school, she had children in the playground. Okay, this is playground. The children walked, hopped and skipped. Some kick and bounce a ball. The children always laughed a lot at playtime. Very good. Number two, Todd lived in the countryside. He loved sport and he climbed and sailed every weekend. When it rained, he called his friends Fred and they played badminton inside. Number three, yesterday David invited his friend Sid to go skating. It was very cold, so they needed hats and scarves. It started to snow, but Sid skated on the lake. David pointed and shouted because Sid wasn't careful. All right, yeah. so they are skating, okay? Yes. So as you can see how huh, we have here, past simple, right? Okay, like walk, hopped, skipped. Those are past simple, okay? Yes. Okay. Next one we have here listening, okay? So, how you are going to listen and then answer, all right? So, we have here one, two, three questions and then four, five, six, okay? Oh, money. All right. Yeah, many. <laughs> I yeah. want you to read number one first. Number one. Uh, how many people does the first speaker in then in then TV? In when you say identify. Ah yes. I then identify identify okay, and name. So, yes. Yeah, by identify and name. Number two. Uh, number two. Number two. What did the first speaker grandfather do in his life? All right. What did the first speaker's grandfather do in his life? Number three. Number three. Mm. Uh, why do why do many people think this? Uh, people think the second speaker grand aunt is actually his grandmother okay very good and number four how is the house different now compared to when the photo was taken number five what was the occasion of the photo that the third speaker talks about number six 
What happened to the uncles of third speaker's grandmother? Okay. Yes. <laughs> so, ha, huh, I want you to listen carefully here. And then you are going to answer these questions. Okay? Yes. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. This photo is very old. I think it's from about 1910, and it looks very yellow. The man at the back, the first one on the left, is my grandfather. His two brothers are Charles and William. William is the one with the open jacket. My grandfather's sister is called Violet. My grandfather was about 22 when this photo was taken. They were outside the family home in Chicago. Two years after this photo, my grandfather got married to a friend of Violet, and my father was born about 10 years after this photo. My grandfather worked for 27 years in a cinema about three blocks from this house. He started selling chocolate bars and soda drinks to people watching silent movies and finished as the manager. He was an incredible man. The girl in this photo is my mother. She was only one year old at the time, maybe a little more. The woman with her isn't her mother, but her mother's sister, Matilda. Matilda never had any children. She never got married. But she was always very close to my mother, and they're together in many pictures. A lot of people think she is my mother's mother. The photo was taken in the 1930s in California, where Matilda lived. California in the 1930s was all country and fields. Background. A what? What? What are you do? What are you saying? Uh, now, Can, now, now. This one? Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. Wait. Until the lift. California in the 1930s was all country and fields. You can see the woods in the background. It was near Hollywood. I went there to that house when I was very young. I remember it. Now it's just another suburb of another city. My brother still has that old car. He loves vintage cars and cleans it every month. I think this is my favorite photo of my mother when she was a child. It's from another world. It's incredible, but the little girl at the front of this photo is my grandmother. Look at her. She was only five years old in this picture, and she still remembers the day it was taken. It was September 1914, and her two uncles, Peter and Lionel, were going to France in the war. They wanted to take a picture. The two women in the middle were Peter's wife and Lionel's girlfriend. They look very sad. You can understand why. The woman at the back worked in my mother's house and the man wearing the dark clothes with a cap was a driver or something like that. My mother knows the full story. If you look very closely, you can see that my grandmother has a tiny handbag in her hand. She was like that. She was a little woman even when she was five years old. She loved her uncles very much, and even now she says things like, My uncle Peter loved cheese. Peter died in the war, sadly, but Lionel came back and became an actor in the theatre. My grandmother got married when she was 17 and had seven children. All right, so now, ha, huh, I want you to listen one more time, okay? And then we will answer. Did you understand? <laughs> you just answer, okay? You just try. Later, yeah. we, you are, I will give you time to, to answer, okay? Yeah. This photo is very old. I think it's from about 1910, and it looks very yellow. The man at the back... The first one on the left is my grandfather. 
His two brothers are Charles and William. William is the one with the open jacket. My grandfather's sister is called Violet. My grandfather was about 22 when this photo was taken. They were outside the family home in Chicago. Two years after this photo, my grandfather got married to a friend of Violet, and my father was born about 10 years after this photo. My grandfather worked for 27 years in a cinema about three blocks from this house. He started selling chocolate bars and soda drinks to people watching silent movies and finished as the manager. He was an incredible man. The girl in this photo is my mother. She was only one year old at the time, maybe a little more. The woman with her isn't her mother, but her mother's sister, Matilda. Matilda never had any children. She never got married. But she was always very close to my mother, and they're together in many pictures. A lot of people think she is my mother's mother. The photo was taken in the 1930s in California where Matilda lived. California in the 1930s was all country and fields. You can see the woods in the background. It was near Hollywood. I went there to that house when I was very young. I remember it. Now it's just another suburb of another city. My brother still has that old car. He loves vintage cars and cleans it every month. I think this is my favorite photo of my mother when she was a child. It's from another world. He does pop, pop. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, wait for a moment. I'm going to skip that one, okay? I went there to that house when I was very young. I remember it. Now it's just another suburb of another city. My brother still has that old car. He loves vintage cars and cleans it every month. I think this is my favorite photo of my mother when she was a child. It's from another world. It's incredible, but the little girl at the front of this photo is my grandmother. Look at her. She was only five years old in this picture, and she still remembers the day it was taken. It was September 1914, and her two uncles, Peter and Lionel, were going to France in the war. They wanted to take a picture. The two women in the middle were Peter's wife and Lionel's girlfriend. They looked very sad. You can understand why. The woman at the back worked in my mother's house and the man wearing the dark clothes with a cap was a driver or something like that. My mother knows the full story. If you look very closely, you can see that my grandmother has a tiny handbag in her hand. She was like that. She was a little woman even when she was five years old. She loved her uncles very much and even now, she says things like, My uncle Peter loved cheese. Peter died in the war, sadly, but Lionel came back and became an actor in the theatre. My grandmother got married when she was 17 and had seven children. Mm-hmm. All right. So, Ha, you done? Uh, Peter. Can you send? Can you send again? Uh, again, listen. Again, listen. <laughs> okay, okay. All right. So I'll send you the audio. Yes. Later, okay. But I cannot send you right now because uh, the audio is is connected to our lesson. Okay, maybe at home you can listen again. But I want you to try, okay. What is your answer here in number one? What do you think? Uh, teacher, I don't, I, I can, I can see. About now, can you see it? Ah, uh, yes, I see. Okay, what do you think is the answer in number one? Oh, uh, number one, I, I think, I think is D, D. D, dog? Yes. 
Okay, what about number two? Number two, I think is A. A? A? Yeah. Okay, number three? Number three is... Um, um, A, A. A, okay, number yeah. three is letter A. I Okay, so this is your answer, okay? So I want you to listen again at home and then try to check if you got the correct answer later, okay? Okay, wait for a moment. I'll send you the other one. Okay, what about here? All right, this one, number four. What do you think is the answer in number four? Number four is... Uh... Number four is C. C. Okay, number four is letter C. Number five. Uh, number five is uh, num e letter letter B. B. Oh, letter B. Okay, number six. Uh, number six. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Okay, you didn't know. All right, so ha, I'll send you these answers. And then, okay, after listening again at home, you can try to answer again, okay? Yeah. All right, so let's skip that first. So we have here the next lesson here. So let's practice our speaking skill. Okay, I want you to, use, uh, to answer these questions. Okay, number one, you are going to use past simple tense in your answers, okay? So yeah. number one, what did you do after school last week? Do you remember? Uh, what did you do last week after school? I, uh, I, um, I, I went, uh, I ran, I ran, I ran. I ran? Yes, I ran, I ran. I, where, where did you go? I run to canteen, canteen, canteen. Okay, <laughs> you run to canteen. Okay. Yes. What uh, else? I buy, I buy, I buy some food. Is it I buy? buy I buy. Uh, I bought, I bought. Okay, I bought some food. Yes. Yeah. Okay, and, very good. And I played, um, with with my friends. Okay, you played with your friends. Okay, yes. how about what did you do last weekend? Uh, okay. uh this uh, Saturday I, and uh, Sunday. What did you do? Yes, I went. I went to. I went to supermarket last weekend. Uh huh. Okay, yes. very good. I went. I went to supermarket this weekend. Okay, yes. what about number three? Did you have fun last weekend? Yes, I did. Okay, yes, you did. What about number four? What did you want to do? La what did you want to do last week? Uh, I want, I, I want, I want it. I want it. I want it to, um, to a holiday. Uh-huh. You want to have an, you want to have a holiday? You want to have a holiday? Yes. Okay, but you don't have holiday last week, right? Yes. <laughs> okay, you still have to go to your class. Okay, next one, huh? We have here pronunciation. Okay. Yes. Pronunciation here. So how do you pronounce that sound? Or do you know? Oh, e s s s e s s s s s. All right. Can you say shh one more time? Shh. Very good. Okay. Shh. Okay. Can you read the first word? Yeah. Uh, brush. All right. Brush. Okay. One more time. Yeah. Uh, wash. Wash. Right. Next. Trash. Trash. Next. Yes. Yeah. Uh, shout. Shout and. And shoot. Shoot. Okay. Very good. Yeah. Brush. Wash, trash, shout, and shoot. So yes. you have a sh sound, okay? Yes. 
All right, the next one is this sound. What do you think is this sound? Okay, very good. Can you say chu? One more time, chu. Okay, next number one. Can you read? Match. Match. Yeah. Watch. Watch. Champion. Uh, one more time, champion. Champion. Okay, very good. Next. Yeah. Uh, cheap. Cheap and? And beat. And beach. Okay, match, watch, champion, cheap, and beach. Okay. Yeah. All right, so now how we will have here a reading. Okay, but before yeah. that, let's have first three minutes break all right okay we will have a break for three minutes and then let's go back here after three minutes okay okay teacher all right let's just drink or do something else okay Peter, I'm ready. Peter? I'm finished. Okay, so let's start. Okay, so we have here. All right, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear. All right, so let's have here the second one. All right, we will read about Chad and Shane, okay? Yes. Okay, so we will read the story and then I want you to underline the words with sound and chest sound okay yes. all right can you read uh gas and sense fly together every day after school they like to read their bikes in the city gas with days send then send will days time mm -hmm. yeah sometimes they go to the dream and play tennis or baseball at night they with rust home and jazz on the internet 
Jazz and Shane are very good friends. Okay, very good. So I will read again. Jazz and Shane play together every day after school. They like to race their bikes in the city. Jad will chase Shane, then Shane will chase Chad. Sometimes they go to the gym and play tennis or baseball. At night, they will rush home and chat on the internet. Chad and Shane are very good friends. Yes. All right, so now uh, I want you to choose the words with sh sound. Can you tell me? Where uh, are the words with sh sound? Uh, um, sh. Yeah, um, sen, sen. All right, Shane. Okay, what else? And uh, and rush, rush, a rush, rush. Yeah. Okay. Yes, and the end. <laughs> and the end. Okay. <laughs> what about ch ch sound? Uh, ch e chat chat. Okay, Chad. Yes, yeah, uh, Chase. 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 Yes, yeah, um, Cream. 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 A uh, what? Can you say it again? A uh, team. Gym. Gym, yes. Yeah. Is this one? Yes. Okay, what else? Uh, and, um, Chad. Chad. Okay, Chad. Okay, one more. Do we have more? No, the end. No more. Okay. So this is correct. Shane and Rush. We also have yes. Chad, Chase, and Chad. But I think Jim is different. Okay. Because G, it is G, Jim. Okay. Yeah. It's different sound. It's not Ch. It's G, yeah. Jim. Okay. All right. So now we will have. The story for luck and key again. So I will. I want you to read again the story about luck and key. Yeah. Hello. Uh, teacher. Are uh -huh. you? Are you? Are you tired? Ah? Uh? Are you tired? No, I'm not. <laughs> Why? All uh, right. I I see. I see your free ear. No, I'm not. I'm just having a hard time with my eyes today <laughs> because looking at the computer, okay, that's why I'm doing like this. My eyes is like this because I'm having a difficult time looking at the computer today, okay? <laughs> All right. All right, let's continue. Hello. Yes, uh, hello, Peter. What are you doing here? Okay, very Hi. good. I got I got two tickets for my school show on Wednesday. Would you like to come? All right, yes. very good. Would you like to come? Yes, uh, yeah, please. Better. Which show are you doing? All right. Yes, please, Peter. Which show are you doing? Yes. Uh, we're doing Peter Pan. Pop pills and parents are in it. Okay, very good. Pupils and parents are in it. Yes. Okay, next one. Wait for a moment. Okay, let's have here. Uh, we are over there in the fifth. Uh, in the fifth row. This. Uh, can you say? Our... Can you say a row? A row. Row. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, these are our chairs. Can you go and guess? us some drinks key no problem lock to lemonade mm -hmm. yes uh, it is green look at him key is look motos mm -hmm. yes uh, i i got the sea and sound to never land to catch you pet the pen come down mm -hmm. here you, 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 Hillary. Oh, can you say pirate? Yes, pirate. pirate. All right, pirate. Okay, next. Yes. Um, I know who you are. Oh, oh, my, my. Oh, I don't see. I don't see. 
Okay, oh. wait. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, my beard. That hurts. Yeah, that hurts. That's did it miss lock or miss lock did it my dad? All right. So, ha, huh, what happened to the story? Uh, I think, I think story lock, lock and key. E, mm -hmm. Interesting. 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 Why? Why do you think yeah. it's interesting? Because, because, uh, because lock and key, lock and key, or uh, lock and key, um, wrong, e wrong. Uh, around, around, around the motto, the Nick mottos. Okay, very good. So they are mistaken again. So they thought, they thought, okay, they thought that it's Lock Motors or Nick Motors, but it's not, right? Yes. It's different. It is uh, his dad, okay? <laughs> All right, that is Peter Pan's dad. All right, so now we are done with our lesson for today, okay? Yes. So we have here um, Unit 14 After School Club. All right, so how can you tell me what are the lessons that you have learned from this lesson? Uh, I, uh... What are the lessons that you have learned? Lesson? Mm -hmm. Teacher? Yes. Lesson. What are the lessons that you have learned? Uh, I uh I learned I learned fourteen I learned, I learned fourteen lessons. Okay. <laughs> yes, you learned unit fourteen. So what are the lessons that we have learned here? What did you learn in this lesson or in the in this unit? Uh I uh I learned I learned vocabulary. E is about school club. School club. Okay, school club. What else? And uh, and 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 uh, instructor. E but e but simple tense. Okay, you have learned the structure about past simple tense and yes. Uh and and pronunciation is the the R. Us. All right. Us. So we have learned two pronunciation in this lesson. We have sh and ch. Okay. Yes. All right. And we also have learned the rules. What are the rules? So these are the rules that we have learned in this lesson. Yeah. Okay. Yes. All right. So now, huh? Okay. So you, I will send you again this lesson, and I want you to listen to the audio. Right, yeah. listen to the audio and then you need to answer, okay? Yes. Here. Listen to this audio. Uh, okay. Teacher, but uh but I I listen. I listen. I listen. Yes. Yes, you need to listen again. I will send it to you, okay? Yes. So I will send you this lesson, but <clears throat> you just click this one. You just click this one, okay? <laughs> Here. Okay, so that you can hear, okay? Yeah. This photo is very... Okay, we also have here Unit 15. So this, yes. is, this will be our new lesson next meeting. Okay? Yes. Exploring our world. Yes. All right, so now ha, I think we are done with this lesson for today. We will continue Unit 15 next meeting on Saturday. Okay? Yes. All right. Yes? Uh, I, I remember, I remember today we have a test. Test. Oh, uh, yes, a test. Oh, I told you to, <laughs> I told you to tell me that before our class. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> okay. I'm so yeah. sorry, huh? Okay. So next meeting. Okay. Next meeting before we start the class, uh, maybe you remind me or, okay, okay. I'll type here. Okay. Teacher. Test. Okay. <laughs> On Saturday. So that we will not forget. Okay. Okay. Teacher. So next meeting, I will give you a test. All right. But 
uh, before, okay? We should start it before the class so that you can have more time, okay? Yeah. All right, on Saturday night. All right? Yes. Okay, so now, huh? All right, we will continue again the exam that says on Saturday. So please remind me, okay? Because sometimes I forgot, okay? Uh, Peter. All right. <laughs> Peter, today, uh, today I, I, I have, I haven't homework. Oh yeah, you don't have any homework. You oh. just need to you just need to listen to the audio, okay? Oh yes. All right. So you need to listen to the audio and tell me the answer next meeting. Okay. Teacher. Okay. Okay. Teacher. All right. So thank you so much. Goodbye. Have a great Bye, day. Teacher. Bye. 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 See you again.